This is the Hammersmith Palais. Now, later on, this venue will be filled with 2,000 plus screaming fans, all dressed in school uniform, I might add, expecting to see the cast of Grange Hill reunited on this very stage for a one-off performance of the top five anti-drugs campaign song, Just Say No. I've genuinely no idea how many of the cast will turn up. If no one turns up, I'm singing it by myself on that stage. It's been 10 days since I set out on my mission and tonight it's the big night. So far, no one's arrived. In fact, no one's even confirmed. To be honest, I'm bricking it. This could be the most embarrassing night of my young life. Just one really is all we need. Then at least I won't be up there on my own singing. Just say no. I can see a car. Is that a car pulling over now? Is that pulling over? It's Lee McDonald's! Rock and roll! What are you doing? It's you got my t-shirt! Come on! <laughs> I want one! I'm wearing your image. How are you feeling? Not too bad. Nervous. <laughs> I'm absolutely shitting myself. 20 years. It's literally 20 years. That was the last time I see him. So yeah, it's going to be really, really weird. Mustafa, aka Roland Browning, has just got out of the car. Oh, Urkan, hello, you lovely man. How you been, young How you kid? doing? It's a real pleasure to see you. <laughs> hello, you old kid. Long time no see. How you keeping? Yeah, I'm trying to look like you now. Aren't I? <laughs> Try one. Sam Murray's now Roland. Oh, I love you, Roland. So that's Lee and Urkan safely inside the venue. But is that going to be it? And we've got someone else. This is just uh, getting better and better all the time. It's George Christopher, my friends. Hello, son. AKA Ziggy Greaves. Hello, mate. How are you doing? Hey, I'm seeing it. I haven't seen half of them for over 15 years or something, 16 years. You know, it'd be, it'd be great to see them again. You know, it's like seeing your old school pals again if you hadn't seen them. Hey! Hey! <laughs> my boys. See you Hello, there, man. <laughs> and we've got someone else, guys. Alison Bettles. How you feeling, Alison? You're right. I've been a bit anxious. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know, I'm shitting myself. Are you shitting it? Are you shitting it? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! Hello! Hello, Johnny. Where are you? God, look at you! Hey, Don't worry. Good job. Good job. Yeah. Good job. Yeah. Good job. 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 How do you feel? No, thank you for inviting us. Hey, it's here. my pleasure. And the longer we're, because we did think we was getting stitched up, to Again, be honest with you. We was all saying, no, no, I can't do that. All of a sudden, just the excitement, just of meeting everyone, and I, I was just, yeah. I, can't, I just, I'm, I can't believe it. So there's going to be like 2,000 people here, so how are you feeling about getting up on that stage in front of them? Totally embarrassed. Hey. What if they go, boo, you get what? off? I can't, I just can't believe it. <laughs> what, are you kidding me? Come no, on. Honestly. That's never going to happen. They're going to go wild. They're not, honestly. I just no, they're not going to go wild. They're but not, they're going to It'd be cool to do it anyway. A few bit... glasses of champagne, I'm sure we'll have a real break. <laughs> yeah, all right then, Lee. Tell us what it's like when you get on. <laughs> the guys might be nervous, but I've got a backup plan to give them some moral support. Here comes the cavalry. Fleur Taylor, a.k.a. Amelda Davis. Joanne Kenny, who played Jane Bishop. Lisa York, a.k.a. Julie Marchant. Mark Savage, or Bully Gripper Stebson. Tim Polly, who played Banksy. And finally, Ruth Carraway, AKA Helen Kelly. So, who's it gonna be? Who's coming? Who's coming? You don't even know who the hell I am, do you? Hello, Charlie. Hello, you smell nice. Hello, you know I am. So I did it. I've managed to reunite the cast of Grange Hill. They're all here, look. I've even got Gripper Stepson. That's that guy there, Mark Savage, in a football manager's coat. I'm not too impressed about him, actually. He just nicked my dinner money. He's there. So I've got them all together for the first time in 20 years. That's a good thing. The question now is, will they sing? Stage and 
introduce the cast of Grange Hill, who are going to give a one-off performance of Just Say No for a packed house of about £3,000, all dressed in school uniform. Come and have a look. It's going to be fantastic. Take a look at this. Look at them. They love it. Look at the kids. Rock and roll. Come on. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Come on, everybody! We've got a massive, massive surprise for you tonight, ladies and gents. I want to get you all ready for it, so after three, I want you to go mental for me as we welcome to the stage the cast of Great Hill! One, two, three! It's Roland! It's Roland Browning! But first, weren't sure, but it's been a reunion, funny as you like, getting on the stage, having a giggle. Some people who I've seen tonight, I think, you know, it's been nice seeing you, let's leave it another 18 years, you know what I mean? Stick a fork in me, I'm done. That was, uh, that was exhausting. To be completely honest with you, the last 10 days has been exhausting. But don't get me wrong, I'm over the moon. Because 10 days ago, I really didn't think I'd be able to pull this off. Because so many people weren't interested. The best thing about tonight isn't what happened on the stage, because what was happening on the stage? The most important thing about tonight is that I got that group of people in a room together for the first time in 20 years, and they kind of loved it. They all got on really, really well. And that, for me, is what it's all about. So that's great. I'm, I'm done. Mission impossible, mission accomplished. Can somebody get me my M&Ms? Can you take the green ones out? Oh, f you don't have to be part of the crowd. Just be who you are and stand up proud. Capturing extraordinary moments in the troubled life of ex-libertine, stalking Pete Doherty is next Tuesday at 10. And next on 4, FAQU. Justin's back with kingpins of comedy, thrashing out the most ridiculous questions you've ever heard. Details on both. Coming straight up next. Say no.